Today, I'd like to teach you how to find the molar mass of magnesium hydrogen carbonate. I have a nice table to help us organize the information. Bam, so the first thing I'm gonna do is write down the elements I see in the compound. So we have magnesium, we got hydrogen, we got carbon and oxygen. Then we're gonna identify the number of atoms of each and that's where the subscripts come into play. So if there's not a subscript at the bottom of the element, write in a one. So there's one magnesium. Now there's also one hydrogen, but be careful, hydrogen is tied up inside of this hydrogen carbonate polyatomic anion, but, and you have two of them. So therefore you'd have two hydrogen. In other words, take the inside subscript and multiply by the outside to find the total. Two for hydrogen. Then carbon, same thing. You got a one, but you got to multiply by the outside, so it's two. And then oxygen, you multiply the inside by the outside, so there's six oxygen, right? Nice and easy. So then we're going to multiply all those number of atoms by the mass of each individual element. And the periodic table helps us out with this. So we got 24.31 units of mass for magnesium. Hydrogen is 1.01, carbon is 12.01, and oxygen is 16. So we're going to write them in the table. This is going to be 24.31. Hydrogen is 1.01, .01, carbon is 12.01, .01, and oxygen is 16. And then all we simply have to do is just multiply this row on across to find the total mass of each element in the compound. So the total mass of magnesium is simply going to be 24.31. The total mass of hydrogen is going to be 2.02. .02, right? The total mass of carbon is going to be 24.02. .02, and the total mass of then oxygen is going to be 96. Then to find the total mass of the entire compound, all you gotta do, literally just add this column on up. So the total mass here of magnesium hydrogen carbonate is going to be 146.35. And that's in terms of grams per mole because we're solving for molar mass, all right? Thanks so much for tuning in, I appreciate it. Like and subscribe if you can, and I'll see you in the next one. Take care.